guys, so today I am going to make a video on how to replace Oppo Sun of Hamilton C1 ventilator. Sometime what happened, machine will not show you the FIR2. Or uh, by the doing the calibration of uh, FI2 O2 cell, still it will not show you FI2. That time we need to replace the O2 cell in your particular life. So what is the average life of O2 cell? It will be depend upon use, or it should be till the one year. So I will show you how to replace the O2 cell. At the back side of machine, you can observe at the bottom there is a one small screw. Just remove this screw. This cover will come downward. Remove the cover. You can observe this is nothing but O2 cell. Right, you just disconnect the cable and rotate it. Don't pull it out, okay? So you have to take care. Just first rotate it. So rotate it properly. Then only it will come out. Don't pull it. So if you thread, if you try to pull it, thread will be damaged. So once it get removed out, take new one. This is your new position. How to fix it again? Just keep it like this. Put inside the slot and rotate properly. Tighten it properly. Right. I have tightened it properly right. and just connect this cable, put this cover, tighten the screw. Right. In this way, we can replace the O2 cell. One more thing, uh, after replacement of O2 cell, uh, make one practice, write date on the O2 cell. So we can calculate average life of the O2 cell. Switch on the machine. Switch on the machine. Machine will take some time to boot up. Wait for some time. So, self test is under process. After completion of self test, now you can just uh, you know that this is a system, right? In system. We can observe test and calibration. So there is O2 cell, right? It get crossed. That means it is not working. Now we have replaced the O2 cell. Now you have to do, you have to perform the O2 cell calibration. Press on this. Now O2 cell calibration in progress. Wait for some time. We have connected central oxygen already. So there are two type of uh, calibrations without. Uh, uh, what we can say that without uh, central oxygen, you can calibrate the machine on 21% on atmospheric oxygen. If you connect it to the central line, you can perform it on to uh, 100% FI2. But for some time, once calibration will be performed successfully, means your O2 cell is working properly, that means it will give you a tick mark. Correct sign will be there. It will show you date, time. Everything will be there. What is the use of O2 cell? What is the FI2 you have to set that FI2 delivered to the patient or not? That has to be monitored with help of O2 cell. This is the basic function of O2 cell. It is only measuring uh, components. Sometimes if O2 cell is defective, that means it will not give you FI2 reading. That means machine will not deliver FI2 to the patient. It is not like that. Machine will deliver only it will not the display. So what is use of FI2 cell or O2 cell? It will just measure the FI2 and display. This is the major role of the O2 cell. Now O2 cell calibration in progress.
So how you went into the calibration mode? Again, I repeat, you have to press on the system. Then test and calibration will be there. And in test and calibration, there will be a O2 cell. Click on the O2 cell. Automatically, machine will start to calibrate the O2 cell. Now. Auto cell calibrated and you can observe today is 9-3-2023 and this is time 12-56. Miss your auto cell is working properly. Right? In this way you can replace the auto cell in Hamilton C1 machine. Thank you.